Hi there everyone, my name is Brandon Potts, I am the Community Manager at Guild of Games and for the Aether 2 project, and I will be taking over AOML this week. Before we get into it, I would like to once again apologize for the lack of airmail last week. I just had gotten back from a pretty long trip, the team's been very busy working on the summer hotfix, so we didn't really have enough time to push something out, but this week I really hope it makes up for it. We're going to go over one of my favorite parts of the hotfix and my favorite parts of the Aether altogether, the newly revamped Aether official server. So the first thing you're going to notice when you log into the Aether official server on the hotfix is you're going to have two items in your inventory, being the AOS handbook and the protection block. The AOS handbook is pretty much exactly what it sounds like. It's going to go over some of the commands, some helpful tips for new players just to help them get started, how to, say, set your home or use the protection block, which I'm going to go over with you now. So the first thing you're probably going to do when you log into the 8th official server is go out, start punching some trees, and make your own house. Now, I didn't realize how long this was going to take, so I've sped this up about two to 3,000% for you. And voila, there we have it. A, uh, it's def definitely a house. It doesn't have doors or windows, but I like it. I put about 20 minutes of my time into it. So, obviously I don't want it to get griefed or destroyed by other players that might be wandering by. So I'm just going to break out one of these floorboards and pop down the protection block. This will create a cuboid protection of about 50 by 50 blocks around the block itself and will prevent anyone except me from breaking, accessing any chests or anything inside of it. Alongside these newly implemented features in grief prevention, we will be doing away with global PvP, which means PvP can only be kept to arenas and minigames. You don't have to be worried about other players at all during your survival experience. We have also been working on developing new ways to play on the 8th official server starting with the summer hotfix. This includes a creative free build world where everyone will have access to creative and can build whatever they want and the implementation of the first mini games starting with the Aetheric survival games and working our way up to many more including a capture the flag game type and gravitite spleef. And one more thing, we've been working on a complete redesign to the Aether2.com site, forums, and all of that that you can preview right now at Aether2.com slash redesign. As we near the end of this week's airmail, let's move on to the Q&A. First off, StormKing32 asks, will the features mentioned in your airmail videos be included in the 164 patch? Things like the revamped AOS and newly designed dungeon system will be included in the summer hotfix, but everything else that we've shown in airmail, including lanterns, book of lore, all that, will be included in mutation. Next up, Logan asks, Will the Aether World Type slash Working Creative Accessory slots be added into the hotfix? 
The Aether World type that we teased not too long ago probably won't be added anytime soon, but you will have access to an Aether Flatland creative preset and single player. As for working creative accessory slots, you may have noticed the tabs above my inventory during the video. The second one from the left is for accessories. These tabs appear in both survival and creative, so you'll be able to access your accessories in both modes. Thanks for tuning in this week, guys. I know it was a bit rocky considering this is the first airmail I've had to do completely by myself before, but rest assured, Oscar should be back next week to bring you your seventh batch of airmail so you won't have to put up with me for very much longer. Until then, you can leave your questions on our Facebook, Twitter, subreddit, aether2.com, or in the comment section below to have a chance to get them answered on next week's airmail. Don't forget to like and subscribe if you want to see more airmail every single week. My name is Randon Potts, and I'll see you on the AOS.